Now we will discuss on the valence band theory. Valence bond theory, primarily the work of Linus Pauling, regarded bonding as characteristics by the overlap of atomic or hybrid orbitals of individual atoms. This is referred to as valence band theory. So, overlap of atomic or hybrid orbitals of individual atoms. The central metal ion makes available a number of vacant orbitals equal to its coordination number. These vacant orbitals will form a covalent bond with the ligand orbitals. So, you are able to see the picture the ammonia ligands bind to the transitional metal ion in theory the bond forms in the re region of overlap between the transition ion hybrids atomic d2 sp3 orbital and the ligands hybrid sp3 atomic orbital this is your d2 d2 sp3 orbital A covalent bond is formed by the overlap of a vacant metal orbital and filled ligand orbital. Here is the vacant metal hybrid atomic orbital. The occupied ligand atomic orbital is the coordinated covalent bond between them. A strong covalent bond is formed only when the orbitals overlap to the maximum extent. You are able to see the normal overlap is your pi orbital and the additional over overlap is referred to as pi bond and also the sigma bond. So the normal one so it's a mistake so a normal bond is nothing but your sigma and the overlapped one is called a pi bond the maximum overlapping is possible only when the metal vacant orbitals undergo a process called hybridization a hybridized orbital has a better directional characteristics than an unhybridized one here is the coordination number with the types of hybridization and the geometrical model if the coordination number is 2, it's sp and linear, 4 sp3 and tetrahedral, 4 dsp3 square planar, 6 d2 or d square sp3 octahedral, 6 sp3 d2 octahedral. This is the overall shape. A species having at least one unpaired electron is said to be paramagnetic. It is attracted by an external field. The paramagnetic moment is given by the following spin only formula. Mu s is equal to root of n into n plus 2 Bose magneton. So mu s is the spin only magnetic moment and n is the number of unpaired electrons. <laughs>